hey guys welcome back to my channel don't forget to like comment and subscribe so the new misfits 13 has been announced and i can't lie it's actually looking interesting i can say a 2v1 outnumbered match fox the g versus most evil tag team so that's fox the g versus most wanted an evil hero and then we've also got Joey Knight versus Baby Hulk and Yadi Gang versus Lil Krakra. I don't know how I feel about a two versus one. Like, how is that going to work? Introducing Outnumbered after an incredible debut KO, Fox takes on most evil tag team in the first ever 2v1 live on the zone boxing from Nashville. The Misfits Boxing Interim Lightweight Tournament also gets underway. More announcements coming soon. Well, unfortunately, there might not be a need for more announcements because I saw on IFN that the full Misfits 13 card was revealed on the DAZN website. Like, they had already posted everything that is happening. So we've got the Foxes G versus Most Wanted and Evil Hero. Then they leaked Anthony Taylor versus Gabe Silver. They also leaked Chris Avila versus Jake. We knew about Lil Krakra and Yadi Gang. We knew about Joey Knight versus Baby Hulk. But they leaked Nikki versus Alexia, Laid Back versus DWG, David Dynamite versus TBD Lightweight. I don't know what that means. But they leaked a lot of things. So we already know everything because... They, like I can't lie, they need to pattern that, like, that can't be happening. Like, hasn't this happened before where the zone will leak stuff that hasn't actually come out? And they knew that they messed up because they gone and took it away. They made the mistake and removed the rest of the card from the article, but it's too late. It's too late. You can fix it, but screenshots last forever. So now we know the full card. What do you guys think about this card? Do you think it's a good card? I think it's good. Like, I'm interested to see it, especially Fox to G versus Most Evil. Like, I just want to know how that's going to work. True Geordie revealed in a YouTube video that KSI versus Wayne Rooney could potentially be happening. There's every possibility if Wayne Rooney accepts the offer and he's got the balls to get in the ring, we could see KSI versus Wayne Rooney this year. And I know that there's actually been talks already about a fight between HS Tiki Toki and Wayne Rooney. HS is uh, another influencer who does big views and is, has a big name in his own right but if Wayne Rooney is coming to influencer boxing he's probably only going to do it for the biggest payday possible even if he does have a warm-up fight first I can't think at 38 years old that Wayne Rooney wants to work his way up the ranks right it's KSI who he's thinking about here surely and that fight would be massive as mental as it sounds that's why it would be massive um, I'm not gonna lie like I don't want to be a Debbie Downer, but am I the only one that wouldn't be interested in seeing Wayne Rooney versus KSI? Like, I'm not going to sit here and act like that's something that excites me because it doesn't. Like, a fight between them two doesn't make me excited. Like, I don't want to see that. I don't want to see Wayne Rooney versus KSI. Like, I don't care to see that. Maybe it would be good, but I just... I don't see the connection. I don't see the correlation. I don't see... I would rather see KSI versus Slim. Like, if you're going to do KSI versus Wayne Rooney, do KSI versus Slim. But obviously, I know that there's reasons for it. And obviously, us who are invested in Misfits and watch Misfits are going to be more interested in KSI versus Slim. But it's like, Wayne Rooney... I don't want to see that. I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm just going to be honest. If it does happen, then maybe I can build up excitement. Like, I don't know.